this is Andrea. And this is the Logitech Mobile Speakerphone P710E. Got it through the Amazon Vine, and I'm going to just show you a little bit about it. This is the top of the device. This area is a navigation system that you'll end up using when you're making calls. Um, it is actually the only real issue I have with this device because these are so close together and if you have big fingers you may inadvertently hit one of the buttons you don't mean to as well as these things being very sensitive to touch. They're flush with the speaker grade and so you have it just could be improved maybe a bit expand these out a little bit maybe put the mute up here and backlight these. That would really help this device tremendously but other than that this device really is a very good one. Um, on par with its price point which I didn't think it would be but the sound quality, call quality, all very good. So what I'm going to do right now is turn it on. This is off. Uh, on the bottom you have uh, the USB um, cable that's actually attached. I like the containment system. You plug in that USB into a AC adapter that it comes with, and I'll show you that, right in there, and plug it into the wall to charge it. It takes about three hours for um, a full charge, and that charge will last about 15 hours which I think is tremendous, great battery life. So anyway, I'm going to turn it on. On the side here, you have the on off, you have the Bluetooth pairing, you have the little battery indicator, if it was low it would be red, and a port for headphones. So you hold that down for a couple of seconds, and there we are, it's up and powered. Now it's blinking that blue light up there. That just means that it's ready to be paired. Now it can be paired NFC or Bluetooth or plugged in with a USB. I'm going to do a Bluetooth pairing with my iPhone 4S. I'll show you here, it's not in the devices yet, but what we need to do is go over here, next to that on off is that Bluetooth button. Now I'm going to hold that down for a second or two, and then it starts searching. Notice how the blue lights go around. And up here on my iPhone, you'll see Logitech speakerphone, not paired, but it's already seeing it. So I'm going to go ahead and touch it, and it will attempt rather rapidly to go ahead and connect it. And there it is, it's connected and paired, and it shows those blue lights all for a second and then it goes green. And that means it is effectively connected to the other device. So they've been paired. So if a phone call came through on my phone to answer it, I'd just press this green button and I'd start talking. And it would be really, really easy to deal with. Um, volume is right here. You just turn things down that way. It's very sensitive. If you want to turn it up, do that and you see the green lights. Again, I wish these little icons were backlit. That would be really helpful. Um, maybe a little wider space, but other than that, not tough to use. Um, call quality was excellent. People didn't even know that I was on a speakerphone, which was great. Um, I, between three to six feet seemed to be the optimum uh, distance and you know bringing more people into a conference call um, great for home uh, for Skype things like that um, also great in an office setting the fact that it's so portable easy to throw into your your bag um, it's not super big I mean I can show you with the iPhone um, you know, it's a little thick a little funny rounded so it's not like straight up and down but really quite portable um, this little, I'm going to move my phone so it doesn't drop down. This little section in here, this slot, is meant to hold up whatever device you want. Uh, it won't work with my iPhone. Now, I'll show you just because it's so thick in this uh, OtterBox case. If I take it out, it would be perfect. Um, it also works with my iPad the same way. Again, not really a lot of things to learn about it, um, just that it works. It works very well. Call quality is excellent. Again, the the real only issues that I have have to do with these buttons not being backlit the mute button being in the middle a little awkward you might inadvertently hang up on someone that could be better up here um, I don't know why I like it there but I always do um, the fact that there you know little fingers could deal with it big fingers might not might not be that easy to see for some people particularly in the dark or in um, dimmer light let's put it that way uh, overall really pleased with it. I like the way it's charged. I like that it already has that with it. It also comes with a soft case, which frankly I think they could leave out or make a semi-hard case. I don't know how much protection it really offers. Um, it's just some place to put it when you travel. 
Um, the, the matte finish doesn't show any fingerprints or anything like that, uh, which I like. The build quality is excellent. Um, if you have any questions or would like more information, um, I'll certainly try and help you out. It, uh, it's a nice device, fairly good price point on it, and uh, works well. Thanks for viewing the reel.